To all my people out there in 2022, let the last two years don't cloud your judgment. Let it be what it is. The last two years has shown us many beautiful sides, but also many ugly sides of ourselves. We cannot kid ourselves with that one. This is what the reality is of our situation. But that doesn't mean that we have to be really, well, down and out about it. The last two years for me was incredible. I have experienced many beautiful things, but also many things of the ugly, the disturbing nature of myself. I understand we have to go what we have to go through. And perhaps through that, we could do a whole lot more of soul searching and inner works and shadow works and light work at the same time. But it's how I see it. As long as there's breath in your lungs, a beat in your heart, and a will, how faint it might be, to conquer another day, do what you gotta do to make it. There's always a chance to do it. So my New Year's resolution, and I think it's very funny that I say that because there's always a resolution that you gotta do. But my New Year's resolution for this year and the years ahead is to just go towards opportunities and chances. Not always to stay in the melancholy lane that I have been in for the last years. However beautiful it might be, just understand what we have to go through. We are preparing ourselves to be the better version of ourselves, to love ourselves even more, and to love each other even more. Even if it's hard, even if it's painful, even if it comes towards so many questions that you want to be answered. Perhaps a good answer is a good, better question still. People. Let 2022 be the year that you could really be yourself. And let 2022 be the year also of kind candor. You gotta be real with yourself and you gotta be real with the people around you. Without the honesty of life, what have you. But I want to say towards everyone, have a beautiful 2022. It's gonna be a good year. Regardless.